Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, so it's Monday, National Trust Day, volunteering. Liam and I were with some other volunteers today uh, doing the first reptile survey of 2017. And I'm just going to leave you with Liam to just talk a little bit about what we get up to. Hello. Um, okay, so what we thought is we'd come and find a mat in situ and show you guys one of the styles that we use. This is a corrugated iron sheet. Um, we drilled holes in them and we label them. Please do not disturb or move this mat. Habitat monitoring in progress. Um, we use a combination of felt and tin. Personally, I prefer the felt ones. They don't make as much noise when you lift them. Under this one, no lizards. Um, but there are some interesting little things happening here. We've uh, unfortunately scared the black ants that are living in here. These little guys, there we go, that's got them out. So these guys over here, they are very important for the silver studded blue uh, conservation. They take the, the larvae down into the nest and they raise them. Anyway, we're not looking at them at the moment. Um, so you want to look for little things like this. You've got a little hole in here. You can often find toads living in them. Sometimes the lizards make their homes under the mats. It's, it's quite rare. But um, we lay, this year we've got 24 uh, over, I think it's eight different areas of the field. Um, we've got a small population of Toka vivipara and it's our third year coming up of reptile surveying. So it's going well. Um, you know, we're busy gathering data on, you know, population size. Um, a variety of other things and I'm running out of so one of the reasons why we do reptile surveys up here is um, this site is called Thickerton Hill it's a triple SI site uh, for lowland heath it's one of the highest lowland heaths in Europe and um, part of its triple SI citation is to restore the heather um, which grows here this used to be a, a woodland um, planted after the Second World War and um, we've done a lot of felling so it's opened the area out it used to be just completely wooded but the heather's coming back we've got all three species of heather that grow here um, and bilberry which are all fantastic for the lizards we're hoping to get um, adders back on site the last one was spotted in 1990 so quite a while back yeah, a long time. Um, and some work that Dan and myself and some others have been doing down at Pool Lane Car Park, we dug out some marshland, created a pool, hoping to get some um, natrix natrix, and um, hopefully over the summer we're gonna have a much better idea of the numbers of reptile on the site, and we'll encourage more people to come and join us. Thank you, thank you, Liam. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as t time goes by of the spring and summer. We'll hopefully have lots of videos and photos of the little critters that we find. Thank you.